Today we are making a bread pudding with butter sauce. What's up guys, it's Connor Minix back with another video and today I'm here with my grandma. Hi everyone. And today we are going to be making grandma's homemade bread pudding with butter sauce. Uh, it's an easy recipe, just good if you have uh, bread left over. Um, it's just one of those good comfort foods. If you want to see some more of our fall and Halloween recipes, make sure that you check out our channel and look at all of our videos. We've made some pumpkin muffins, we've done um, some Halloween snacks. But also make sure that if you like this video, you hit the subscribe button and click the bell to be notified every time we upload a new video. Okay, let's get started. The thing you want to do is cube up your bread. You need about eight slices, um, so about four cups of uh, cubed up bread. So just set that aside, <clears throat> and then you want to cook two cups of milk in a quarter cup of butter, half a stick. And you're going to cook this four to seven minutes, and then we'll pour it over the bread. <laughs> okay, so I ended up switching to a bigger cooker because it kept boiling over. So you might want to start out with a saucepan about this size. But I've boiled it about five minutes now. So I'm going to pour it over the bread. And then we leave it set for 10 minutes. Okay, the 10 minutes is up. So now we're going to add the rest of the ingredients, which is two slightly beaten eggs, half a cup of sugar, half a teaspoon of cinnamon, half a teaspoon of nutmeg one tablespoon of vanilla flavoring. So you're going to stir this together. Then we're going to pour it into a grease casserole dish. Um, if you want like a 9 by 13 dish, you just need to double all the ingredients. Pour this in. And we're going to put it in the oven at 350 and bake it about 40 to 50 minutes. We'll be back. Okay, about 10 minutes before the bread pudding gets done, you can start the sauce. So we're going to combine a half a cup of brown sugar, half a cup of granulated sugar, and a half a cup of heavy whipping cream. A half a cup of butter, which is one stick. So you want to bring this to a boil over medium heat, stirring occasionally, and boil it for five to eight minutes. Okay, so we've cooked this about five, six minutes. Just it's thickening until it thickens a little bit. And then I'm going to remove it from the heat and add a tablespoon of vanilla flavoring. Okay, and we'll check our bread pudding. It should be done until the middle set so that looks good okay guys we are back and we have our bread pudding done it turned out great it smells good and looks good um and then the sauce we just serve that with a very big ladle <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> we're going to put a little bit on top. You could probably put it on the whole thing, but we're just doing it separate in case somebody doesn't like it quite as sweet. If you want whipped cream on top, just thaw it out earlier. <laughs> like it? I do. It's good. Oh, I forgot to say if you want, uh, if you like raisins in it, put that in with the bread before you soak it. Like a half a cup of raisins. Okay, so we hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure that you share it with your friends and um, uh, also leave a like and leave a comment telling us what you want to see us make next. And make sure you like and subscribe and we'll see you guys later. Ready? One, two, three. Bye. Bye.